Now let's introduce a runtime error in our code. Let's enable Omniscient Debugging. Go to the Options menu, Corona Options, Debugger, and set the snapshot interval to 5. This will take a variable snapshot every 5 lines of code. Lower numbers give us finer precision, but may slow down the program. Omniscient Debugging will store the execution state of our code line by line so that we can step back and examine errors after they occur. Just restart the simulator and click play game. A quick note, if you cannot restart the simulator because the debugger has halted execution, simply stop debugging and start again. You will see an error on the console and Cider has taken us to the exact line where the error occurred. Although the error is obvious in this case, sometimes it may not be. To find out what caused the error, just click step back and you will see the variables that may have caused it. This is very useful for errors that occur intermittently where print debugging or even breakpoints may not help much. Thanks for watching.